Hey, hey, what's going on? It's Anthok Gaming here, also known as Anthony or Anthok. I uh, just want to do a really quick video update of the Mini Dex mod. I uh, did a unboxing video a long time ago, along with an install and just brief explanation of the software used for the Mini Dex mod. Um, and I want to do an update because I said in that video I would do an update. Now it's been quite a long time. I have used the Mini Dex mod in my index for about six months now. And uh, every time I stream with my index, the Mini Dex mod is running. In fact, every time I play with my index, the Mini Dex mod is running. Even if I'm not streaming, I just leave it in there. Uh, I also want to talk about a couple things that I've noticed using the Minidex mod. Um, one thing I mentioned was heat. I noticed maybe when I first started using it, it might be a little bit warm with the Minidex mod installed. And I thought, well, it could be because there's some circulation through this upper vent that is blocked. Well, let me show you what I've actually done. I've taken off the 3D printed part. You can see that the Minidex mod is just kind of placed in there and it actually holds in pretty well, but it is slightly off. It's slightly off center here. It, uh, you know, the 3D print that goes in there holds it perfectly in. Well, now this isn't really perfect. So it kind of just sits there. It moves around a little bit, but with a little bit of adjustment, it looks fine. Um, I've noticed a little bit of better airflow now that I've taken off the 3D printed part and I've actually heard through Reddit that the new 3D print does allow more airflow. So it sounds like they've updated this issue. Um, what I've still noticed though is that it does have some increased heat, um, especially from when I play with my Quest. If I'm playing VR with my Quest, I don't notice the heat that I do of the index. That might just be an index thing as a whole, not because of the Minidex mod. But again, like I said, I only play with this installed. I can play the Quest for probably four or five hours completely uninterrupted. I have no issues. Um, I'll, I'll be in the Quest for a long time. The index though, I do find uh, with the Minidex mod, about after two hours, I'm like, Ugh, I don't know if I can keep going. It's getting warm and whatnot. Again, that might not be because of the mini decks. It might just be because of the index in general, uh, but that's just my take on it. Uh, would I recommend you getting a mini decks mod so you can show some sort of LED panel in the front? Um, that's up to you. I mean, it's really not that expensive and I don't know of really anything that runs inside of this USB port that you would rather purchase. Uh, potentially the fans, those might help with cooling. I know people make fans that go in here. Um, so if that's something that you want, maybe I should look into that because I'm saying it's getting warm. Um, but the Minidex mod is really cool. I think it looks nice. Uh, people ask about it on stream all the time. Um, they're like, are, are your eyes actually blinking like when you really blink in the headset? No, this is just programmed and it's I answer that all the time. Um, I just program this in to have the eyes kind of look back and forth and then blink. It's kind of cool. You could put messages on here and such. Uh, I find that when I'm standing kind of farther away though, you can't really read the messages. So it's just eyeballs. I think it's kind of funny. Anyway, that's my quick update for the mini decks mod. Uh, thanks for watching. And like I mentioned, I do stream on Twitch. If you want to check that out, Anthok Gaming. Uh, and if you're not subscribed to the YouTube channel here, um, if you're interested in this content, it'd be awesome if you did subscribe. Um, that way you can see when I post new videos. Anyway, take care and happy new year.